Hello class, for this lesson we want to talk about the musical star. So the 1930s produced many of the musical stars that would continue to be popular for the next 20 years. So we're going to stick with the 30s for this lesson. So we had Al Jolson from The Jazz Singer, as previously mentioned. Ruby Keeler, who was in uh, Gold Diggers, uh, which we just watched. Shirley Temple, the little girl with the, with the curls. Uh, the Marx Brothers. Uh, Bing Crosby with the deep voice, Judy Garland, who of course you know, and Fred Astaire. And Fred Astaire is our topic for this lesson. So Astaire's breakout role um, with his most popular partner, who was Ginger Rogers, who we also saw in, uh, in Gold Diggers too, uh, was in Flying Down to Rio, which was made in 1933. Now, they weren't actually the featured stars in that film, but they had a dance sequence that kind of broke them out. So the, the pair would go on to make a string of popular films, uh, The Gay, Divorcee, Top Hat, Swing Time, Follow the Fleet, and Shall We Dance, and then they split up in 1939, uh, a stare to continue making um, films with other dancing partners, and uh, Rogers went on to do um, serious drama instead. So Swing Time is our film for this lesson. So this was uh, Astaire and Rogers' fourth film together, uh, considered to be one of their best, considered by me to be one of their best. I've seen the other ones, and I like this one the best. It has the best dance sequences, I think. So the story is fairly generic in most of these, and you'll find this in, in a lot of musicals. Uh, maybe the story isn't the best, but it's the musical numbers you're really there for. So Astaire plays a uh, gambling dancer. He often plays a gambler. I don't know if he had a problem with that, but uh, it was possible. Um, he somehow gets himself into romantic trouble. Um, Rogers can't decide whether or not she wants to deal with Astaire and his problems or not. There's a great deal of singing and dancing throughout the, the film. And ultimately, they end up setting aside their differences and fall in love. You know this is going to happen. This is a musical. Bad things don't happen at the end of most musicals. Well, except for West Side Story, but we're not watching West Side Story. Enjoy the film. It's got some really um, awesome dance numbers, and uh, it's a pretty enjoyable film.